Hey, yes, Nick Alex, back again tonight. I've got another one for you tonight. This is called Checkmate. Yes, Checkmate, as you can see by the piece here and the piece here. And he's got some sort of camera, so he must be the king or the queen. I can't remember now. I think that's the king in it, yeah. Anyway, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. We're back with Checkmate. It's based on Slacko, so that's another pup derivative. But this time we've got the latest LXDE. Oh, yes, indeed. He's made quite a few of these, guy. And he's just ported it over to Wary. So if you've got Wary, or Racy Wary, you can also have LXDE on there too. So that'd be super duper duper super duper super duper So, installation takes around about three minutes. That's including all the bits and bobs. There's some few slow things, and I'll come with them in a minute for you and tell you what we're about. Right, get your time, got my Ethernet connection. Now, when you first boot up, that is connected to a WLAN or your wireless. Now, I've got Ethernet here, so I had to change that. But if you've got wireless, you'll be able to do it. Frisbee here, as far as I'm aware, is it Frisbee? Yeah, for your network, especially if you're wireless, anyway. You've got there, and you've got the sound, and you've got my network again. So you've got two networks. Not really good done, but hey, so you just come out, it's all right. It works really nice. It's quite smooth, actually. I was quite impressed. I really was, yeah. So we've got our file manager. So I'll go up here to my file manager, open him up. As you can see, it's LXDE. So I'll go to help about PC Man FM is your baby here. It's not the latest and greatest, but hey, who cares? It does what it says on Latin. Bonjour. Okay, you also get Qt Web as your basic browser. Yeah, Qt Web. I don't know why. I mean, it is quite quick actually, so I'll open it up for you. We'll have a quick look and you'll see what's going down. This is the only thing about Slacko at the moment. It, it sort of hangs sometimes. It, maybe it's just me and the, the hardware I'm using, but hey, on different machines it runs perfect. And no, it really does. Super duper. So yeah, we're using the Qt web browser. La -de -da -de -da -de -da -de -da. Comparison, so we've got a comparison. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it says yes, 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 no, no, for the Firefox 3.5, which is really old now, as we all know, Safari, Opera, Chrome. These are really all old browsers to compare it to. So they really, 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 really need to update this section here, don't they? But yeah, in the whole it's all right. So if I go over here, go, go to Puppy Linux. There we go. It will take us there. We'll go down there. And we can see it's quite quick, isn't it? It's quite quick. Go to the forum, which will open a new tab up for us. I'll get rid of the old one. And I go down to the puppy derivative section for your satisfaction. And this is the baby here, I think we're using. Is that the one? Oh, this would QT get this coming up. Yeah. This, oh, sorry. I even went to the wrong page. He's, he's done XSC, he's done GNOME, he's done MATE, he's done quite a few of this guy. He's well hard, isn't he? He's getting on the on the thing. Yeah, he's really getting on it, isn't he? So this is the one we've got here, sorry, the LXDE version. You can download it here. Here's the wary one if you want if you've got wary. So that's okay there. If you've got an older machine. But you can get the other ones as well. I've got the other one here that runs Slacko. And as you can see he's done some screenshots here, so that's hunkily dory, blah blah blah. If you like it, go download it and see what you reckon. Because I think it's really, really good. But to make sure everything worked, I installed my drivers for my graphics card. I installed a few programs. Right, Slick Pet is slow to download nearly anything you want to do. So if you really want to do anything, if we go to setup, I'll show you what I mean. If I can find it. I use Grub for DOS, by the way, to do this. And the Puppy Universal Installer works fine, no big deal. Set up Puppy, so we'll go to the Puppy Package Manager. It's still quite slow. All slack hose are this slow though. And, well, actually, Weary Race ain't so fast either, to be really honest with you. So that really needs to be worked on. There's obviously something going on there, or it's using too much of some one thing or the other. On the other hand, I've got an older laptop that I'm using Racy Weary on. And when I mean old, I mean it's about six years old. It's super, super fast. So it might be hardware dependent, really. So anyway, we'll wait for the puppy package to come up. Now, I've installed quite a bit here. Yes, I have. I've fuck on uninstall, you see what I've installed. I've installed the Mesa driver, Dead Beef, the Flash Player, Firefox 12, and unfortunately is the nightly build, so we can't update to the Firefox 13, but there is another way around that, by the way. Yeah, I'll tell you another time. I've also installed Google Chrome, not Chromium, just to make sure it all works, because on some it didn't actually work for me, and Asunder 2.0, which I've ripped some C some CD tracks just to make sure it all works in Dead Beef. So yeah, that's hunky dory. Should I say I do something? You should have known how to do it really yourself, really. But you know what? Because I like you, what should I do? Mm, we'll install Dilo just for a laugh. <clears throat> All you do is click on it once. There's no dependencies. Or if there is, it will download them for you, hopefully. Install Dilo. We wait a little second. I'll have some drinkage. Hold on a second. Uh, uh, uh. Mm, sort of appley again. Mm, very nice. 
Well, I'm gonna download from the Netherlands. <sighs> and download my package. Okay. So I download my package. When it comes up, this is a bit of me not about being slow. Okay. It didn't happen in uh, five two eight. So you know, so it's gone down there. I still love using it, don't get me wrong, it's a lovely distro to use. And I think Puppy has really come of age now, especially now Slacko's maturing. Although it's got some rough edges that need doing, but the guys will get that done eventually, as you all know. So it's, please wait, I'm updating our help page, menu. This can take a long bit with the old tango bar in the middle. Oh, by the way, if you see the blank bit here, it's always done that when recording for me, so don't worry about it. It's nothing you can see, or there's nothing wrong with your web browser or your flash player or whatever. It's just, it just happens, okay? But once you've got it installed, especially if you've got a USB key, you're going to fly, 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 fly. You know what? It's so slow. I'm going to go and see what it's doing. Okay, we've got to set up. If we go to system memory, no, we've got to status and configs. We'll open up HTOP, see what HTOP's doing. As you can see, it's using a load of CPU. Now, I did notice while using this, it likes a bit of CPU, even though it's LXDE, but it doesn't want to touch your memory. You know what I mean? It doesn't want to, it's got 66. Not even touching it. It's not even doing anything. But CPU-wise, as all the slackers I've used, it likes it a bit, but this one even more so. Okay. Yes. But again, as I said before, on other hardware, it just doesn't. Okay, so... I need to get some new hardware, which I have. I've got the new CPU, by the way, if anybody wants to be interested in it. I've got the 8-core AMD bulldozer. I've got the old CPU. Just got a bit more cash to get the rest of the bits to go with it, okay? Yeah, it will come in time, and then we can see some more stuff, and I can make that a lot bigger. Anyway, the Tango bar seems to have gone. It's still doing stuff. I'm probably waiting for some more stuff to come up. Blah, blah. I know it's a bit long, but at least this is showing you when you install stuff via Slacko or this particular distribution or PET, should we say, or not PET, Paplet is the one I was looking for. You'll know what you're going through. So if you think it's doing stuff and it's taking a long time, it's not you. This is what it does. You just go away, have a cup of tea if you're in the UK, go have a cup of coffee if you're in Europe or the States. You have a cup of pineapple, whatever, if you're in somewhere else. And you have a cup of lizard if you're in Australia. You have a cup of snow if you're in Antarctica. Just a cup of something, really, when you think about it. So we've got no shared dependencies. So we click OK. And there we go. So that was all done. Now I'm going to let it rest for a bit, if you just hang on. And as you can see, it's settling down the old CPU. But it's not going down too much, is it? OK, so what I'm going to do, get rid of that, see if it goes even more. I'll give it a couple of seconds just to settle. Okay, so we're using. Mm, do you see what I mean about the CPU usage? I'll need to install something there, sort that out, don't I? Really, when I think about it, see, it's just doing what it wants to do. Mm, not nice, really. Anyway, as I said before, if I go to multimedia, I installed Dead Beef, Dead Beef, and I ripped it in asunder. Play Super Duper. I ripped some S E A B. So if you have a there, works fine. Lovely jubbly. Okay. Go straight away in this one. Super duper. Okay. And a Sunder and Google Chrome. So what I'm going to do, I'll open up Firefox for you. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see, it's a nightly build. Okay. Then we'll go again back to the internet and we'll go to Google Chrome. Dun, 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 dun. Opens all nice. See, runs really nice. Really, really nice. It's just over 120 megabytes to download. So you've got no excuse not to go and get it and give it a try. Especially for like LXDE, which I do anyway, and XFC. So super of the duper. Nice. Sneaky Linux is going to give this one 90%. Although it could be 89. It's in between. But I like it. Sneaky Linux out. I'll see you later. Bye bye.